What's up, man? It's your big brother, K. Reno. I want to shout out to my homie, Kofi, from Kofi's Universe. Y'all make sure to subscribe to his channel and support everything he got going on because he be dropping that knowledge. Yeah! YouTube salute. OJ has said Jay-Z got it all wrong in his infamous song, The Story of OJ, and that a particular line on the track is a lot deeper than it seems on the surface. If you're new to my channel, thumbs up the video. Hit that sub button, click that bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. Listen to this audio. OJ, yeah. I want to ask you, what about that line when Jay-Z, uh, I'm not black, I'm OJ? Well, first of all, he didn't say it right. Johnny was talking to me about it. And all they was going on is black, black, black. I said, man, black, man, black. This is me. It's about OJ. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, it wasn't about, uh, wasn't about black or white. It was about guys were after me. <laughs> that's, that's how that was expressed. It wasn't, I'm not black. It ain't about being black. It's about me. All right, so that's blogger Augustus Lamont caught up with um, OJ. And this was like, what, two weeks ago? Yeah, about two weeks ago. Almost like a week ago, my bad. So he asked him about, I'm not black, I'm OJ. Okay. <laughs> but um, you heard what he said. It wasn't about a black or white. It was about me. These guys are after me, and the guys he's talking about is the judicial system, the police state, you know, um, Beverly Hills Police Department. We're talking about the DA, the judge, everybody. Um, so people thought at that time, you know, when Jay Z dropped that, like, man, that, that's that was a classic, you know, that was a classic, and that was a great line he said. I think OJ is, um, miseducated on this situation is yes it was about you but you was you were a black man think about it you was with a white woman and you already know how they feel about black men dating white women they frown upon interracial um dating oj if you look at history as far as in american history when you think about the transatlantic slave trade when you think about how slavery built this country and when white women would have sex with enslaved Africans on the plantation behind their husband's back, which is our slave owners, you know, if they got caught, the white woman would lie. What's going to happen? Okay, he's going to get castrated, lynched. Think about that. And in this situation, what happened with OJ? Um, White woman was murdered, right? Nicole was murdered. All right. Um, he allegedly did it, but he got off. He was um, found not guilty. And they try to lynch him in a court. They economically lynch him in, in, in civil court. They did. People got money on, in, on the civil side. But in the criminal court building, CCB, downtown Los Angeles, they was trying to lynch him. So I don't think I don't think he understands how it's all connects. And Jay Z, when he dropped the four 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 album, that album came out twenty seventeen. You know that was probably like a, a conscious album. People were saying that oh Jay Z finally dropping a conscious album. Yada yada yada. It was just more about just generational wealth and waking people up with what was going on in the world. But you got to understand. And I'm not going to actually tell nobody not to date outside your race. You can date non-black women if you're a black man. It is what it is. But always understand that this is America. And they're going to always look at you different. Even when the police pull you over, they're not going to say, oh, you got a white wife? Go ahead. I'm going to let you go. Now, that's negative. Oh, you have biracial children? Your children are black. We're going we're gonna to give y'all a pass. Nah, not necessarily. It don't work like that. Look at Colin Kaepernick. You know, he didn't get no pass. You know, there's so many people out here. It doesn't matter if you're dark skin and you have full 100% African blood or you a crossbreed or, you know, you're mixed. It don't matter. Like, the system is the system. It's designed. 
people can say, well, people are not racist. I'm not talking about people being racist. I'm talking about the system, systematic racism we're dealing with. And OJ, that was systematic racism. Because even after that, didn't OJ go to um, jail in 2007, 2008, right? Everybody remember that. Remember over the member Bella when um, he was in Vegas and one of, the, one of his friends said, oh, they got your member Bella in a the, in the hotel room. He went up there talking about, um, he said, I'm OJ, I'm OJ. Talking about like, don't make me shoot your motherfucking ass. Allegedly he said that, but I know they had him on audio. They had the, they, they recorded him. He said, um, I'm a straight shooter. <laughs> Like, but he talking like that, was that more because he was black or was that more because of OJ? It's a combination of both. They couldn't catch him for the two, the double homicides in, in, um, in 1994, 1995, excuse me, 95, 96. They couldn't catch him for them double homicides, remember? Okay, now they're like, we got your ass now and we got you on audio making a terrorist threat to somebody in a hotel room. You know, so it's like they had to do something to him so he could sit here and say, oh, the system is against me at that time. The system is against me. This is unfair. I'm a black man. So was it you a black man or was you OJ at the time in 2007, 2008? So pick your poison. Post your comments below. Hulk smash Black Panther, the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. If you want to support and donate to the channel. I have Patreon, patreon.com slash Kofi Universe. Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs, everything's in the description. Until next time, salute.